Hey, 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 hi. Facebook world. <laughs> this is my friend Vicky. Vicky, say hi. Hello. Um, I'm Emily Klotz, in case some of you that are on Vicky's page don't know me. And this is Vicky. How do you say your last name? Karis. Karis. Vicky Karis. She's a friend of mine that um, we live about an hour apart, mm -hmm. but we have been friends for a few years now mm -hmm. through church activities and mm -hmm. women's ministry and stuff. Mm -hmm. And um, we have been actually in business together since last year, since last summer. Mm -hmm. And she's on my business team, which is super fun. I want to talk to you guys about that a little bit more. Um, she's an amazing, amazing woman, awesome heart. You guys are going to love her. <laughs> You're going to totally love her. She owns a salon mm -hmm. in Traverse City, Michigan. Um, also a hairstylist for a lot of years. So mm -hmm. how long, Vicki, have you been a hairstylist? I've been a hairstylist for around 35 years now. Wow. And, okay. Yes, and I've had my own business being self-employed for at least 25 of those years. Oh my goodness. Actually. So you've owned a salon yes. and done mm -hmm. your own hair mm -hmm. and you've been a hairstylist for, yeah. okay, 25 out of those 35 years. Actually, more like wow. 40 now that I think about it. It's more like 40 Closer years. to 40, okay. Yeah, I'm, 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 Five years I'm ago, older. it was 35. Yes. Yeah, yeah, I get it. No. Uh, yeah. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Wow, so you probably have seen a lot of changes in the hair industry over yes, that time. definitely. What are some of the changes that you've seen um, over time? Well, you know, I was attracted to more natural looks from the beginning, and mm -hmm. so I almost didn't get into doing hair because I couldn't stand the shampoo and sets and things like that, and that says how old I am. So, you know, I was doing <laughs> those shampoo and sets, and it was boring. And what does that mean? What Like, people who don't do hair, what is a shampoo and set? Uh, roller sets roller and sets. back combing and okay. all that Was that the stuff. 80s? Yes. Yeah, I grew up in the yeah, 80s. Yeah, so big hair. 70s even. Yeah. 70s, mm -hmm. 80s, big hair. Okay, awesome. Yeah. So, so Vicki has seen a lot of change in it, um, from shampoo and sets, mm -hmm. <laughs> roller sets, to now like we're back to natural, more natural yeah. looking hair, right. but wanting healthy products to right. do that, right? Right. So, um, why? That kind of leads me into. You and I are in money together. Mm -hmm. We do business with uh, the number one hair care company in the world, right. number one network marketing company in the world, mm -hmm. and now we have we are um, one of the largest skincare companies as well mm -hmm. in the world. So, uh, and naturally based. So, why did you decide to jump into business well, with money? in the first place. And this um, was last summer, right, that you started this? It was last summer mm -hmm. that you invited me to try the products mm -hmm. and I wasn't sure because you weren't a hairstylist. Right. But um, that was my first thought. <laughs> I don't know much. <laughs> well, I was like, why, no, why it's true. are those so special? So I took the samples mm -hmm. and saw the difference in my hair immediately. And mm, okay. I thought, wow, I need to think about this. Mm -hmm. And then as time went on, um, I just jumped in and yeah, yeah here I am. Awesome. Yeah. Okay, so it was kind of the products that really sold mm -hmm. you right away. Mm -hmm. You tried just a sample, which mm -hmm. is really a one or two use mm -hmm. thing, and you could tell the difference between right. what you were already right. using. And yes. being in hair for 20, 35 to 40 years, you have tried a lot of different hair yes, stuff. Yes, right? and, that, and that was part of it too because I exhausted myself from looking at all these different hair product lines, and I really wanted to have something that I was very secure with, that I could tell my clients about, and that I was very, mm. I found out as time went on how passionate I really was about these products, right. because they produce, and um, just to see the difference in the people that I'm doing their hair, or, and that have signed up to um, be a VIP to sell, or to um, have the products. Right. Yeah. So in your salon, sounds like you're using Monet products on all of your clients. Mm -hmm as their hairstylist yes. and use it on yourself and are loving it and you're finding out that it really works and stuff. Um, so well, let's talk about the products for a minute. What are some of your favorite products? Like why do you why do you love it so much okay. and what do you feel like works really well? Um, what are a few well, of your favorites? Hey I Megan! I like the Rejuvenique oil Ooh, mm -hmm. a lot. Um, why? Because why there are so many uses <laughs> for it. Mm -hmm. um, I noticed a lot of difference in my hair from putting it on my hair after I style it even and um, just to finish it and 
actually there's so many uses I mean I put it in my makeup mm -hmm. in my mascara mm -hmm. um, on my skin on my face um, so this is a really great product. what do you think and it what do you notice it does for you like what does it do for your hair and your skin? Um, well it just calms it down I mean it's mm -hmm. just like it makes it shiny and it makes it feel good and I love the I mean, smell. Fabulous hair. Look at this, you guys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Gorgeous. And I've gotten a lot of compliments, I have to say, since I've been using the Monet line and um, everyone that, you know, they can tell the difference right away with the Rouge Vinique oil. Mm -hmm. um, putting it on at night for a treatment and then washing my hair the next day, it's in better shape. Mm -hmm. My hair is double processed, um, so it needs a lot of TLC and that. And this is TLC in a bottle. Yes. <laughs> for your hair, yes. scalp, skin, Definitely. nails, yeah. anything, yeah. right? Exactly. Yeah. So this is our flagship product, you guys, that don't know much about money, and it is infused into most of our products. Yes. Most of our other products mm -hmm. and the reason that it works as well as it does it's very different from like a Moroccan oil or um, I don't know some other hair yeah, oils that people use so anyways oils. lots of different mm -hmm. oils people use are normally just set on top of the hair and make it shiny because it coats the hair this is formulated with tiny molecules so that it will actually penetrate the hair strand and your skin and it will go in to bring the healing to the, from the inside out it's a blend of 13 botanical oils instead of just a one oil that like I said sets on top it's actually has tiny little molecules that goes to the middle of the hair and heals it from the inside out same yeah. with your skin, yeah. so yeah, it's great right. stuff. Yes. Um, what then else? Then I would say, I love the texture spray, and oh, this, I have the champ with me right now. Yeah, yeah. The dry shampoo is amazing, um, just because it doesn't build up on the hair. Yeah. And, you, and it actually gives it volume. Mm. I, I feel it gives it volume. I think so, too. Um, yeah. And it can be used as a texture spray, in my opinion. Right, I agree. I yeah. love that. And it's no butane or propane or any bad stuff that mm -hmm. <laughs> normal dry yeah. shampoos have and right. they really damage your yeah. hair and your scalp, you know. The blowout cream for um, putting on your hair before you blow dry your hair, yeah. it makes such a big difference. Um, Show them what so that looks like. this is a cute cream. little bottle. I love that. And yeah, what does that do for your hair? Oh, it just protects my hair from the dryer and also mm -hmm. it just makes it it makes it feel a lot better. It's not as dry. Mm. Gives it some shine. Yeah. Um, it smells awesome. Yeah. And I think that's what I like about the products because smell is a big thing for me, and, mm. and everything smells good mm -hmm. in my opinion. It does. And it looks so pretty yeah, too. They do. They're so nice packaging and mm -hmm. rejuva beads um, for split ends. And yeah. Really Award-winning guys, mm -hmm. split and mender, yeah. and it really does and work. It's amazing. I mean, that was probably one of the first products that I was very impressed with. Yeah. Because my hair was fried and so this really worked for me that's awesome yeah. so let's move on from the products a minute because we could talk about products all day because they're all yeah. so amazing mm -hmm. <laughs> but let's go back to you started with this business last summer mm -hmm. and what is it because you came in because of the products right because you knew like from sampling them you knew they worked and you could stand behind the products for your for your um for your clients. Right. What did you find out once you joined this business? Being a network marketing business is a little different than yeah. being a salon owner yeah. and a hairstylist. Mm -hmm. What did you find out that you loved about the company, about our team, mm -hmm. uh, being part of a, a business team, and um, that kind of thing? Right. Well, I liked how the website was set up. I liked the integrity of the company. Mm -hmm. I liked that it was um, that they owned the company. And that it was local. I mean, in the United States, I like the that plant-based, um, the quality of the product. So I was sold on that. And then as time went on, actually, I learned more about the company because mm -hmm. honestly, I did not do my research on the company, and then I just kind of fell into it. Yeah. And I think the camaraderie of um, the teamwork with the people that are involved with Monet, and that um, they are so helpful. And just for my first launch that I had um, a couple people here yeah. and then Emily got to be at one uh -huh. of them and yes. and it made me feel really good that I wasn't by myself and that I had a lot of help. Yeah, so, I love that about our mm -hmm. team. We love to help each other. Mm -hmm. We want to like cheer each other on and nobody tries to step on other people to try to get ahead. We right. really want to try to like help each other mm -hmm. succeed because 
we succeed more when our team succeeds. Right. You know, right. that's the way the company right. is set up and the yeah. way the comp plan is set and up. And that's a rare thing for women. It is, so right. So that's impressive in itself that yeah. there's so many women that are helping each other and not really showing like they're competing against each right. other. Right, that's mm -hmm. it. Yes, and so because of that, I feel like we're all getting a lot of personal freedom and personal growth um, mm -hmm. by being in business together as well. Uh, so what else have you noticed as a stylist, because you value these good healthy products and they really work, mm -hmm. um, what is it like selling it to your clients? Like take me through what you talk about with your clients right. when you're doing their hair yeah. um, and your friends. What, like why is that a natural fit for a, a stylist? Well, I can hardly not talk about the products <laughs> because I'm noticing the difference on their hair mm -hmm. and um, I want them to use them. <laughs> I want them to continue to use them yeah. and not just be in my salon. Yeah. So it's easy for me because I'm so passionate about the products mm -hmm. and I usually give samples you know just to kind of get them used to using it for a little bit on their own on as themselves. well. Yeah. Um, so it's I don't know, it's just really easy to talk about them because they're so fit. great and there's so many, like they love the smell and the mm -hmm. finish, even the hairspray, you know, mm -hmm. usually you're gagging from hairspray right. and, and this hairspray, you know, finishing somebody off and spraying them and going, oh, what is that? You know, that smells great. They love it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Yeah. My mom's hairstylist in Grand Rapids, she loves, my mom brings all her money stuff to the salon to have mm -hmm. them do her hair with it. and her hairstylist like this is my favorite hairspray ever and she's like, like a product yeah. junkie you know yeah. so that's good stuff guys yeah um what else have you noticed about money that you feel like is ideal deal for stylist uh why is it a good business for other stylists to be part of or salon owners to be part of well there's so many benefits of mm -hmm. um just like right for example this is a slow time of year in a way mm -hmm. because it's after christmas right and a lot of your people are um going south and things like that so i've had more time to commit to being in this business and um it's just exciting, it's fun. It's really fun to um, make contacts with people and reach out to people. It helps other women, like if they wanted to have a business that, and make some extra money, even if, there isn't a, if they're not a hairstylist, they can even do it. So I'm seeing yeah. the benefits of it and I, I feel good about helping them and getting them going on it. And so right now it's like I just have mostly VIPs, but I did just sign up a market partner. Woo! So I'm really excited about that. And um, yeah, it's just, it's a fun business, but there's so many perks. And I, and I found out that I was qualified to go to Las Vegas on a trip. Free trip! trip. And <laughs> that was even a surprise because I'm like, what? I didn't yes. know that was, so that's how much I paid attention to it's all these so little fun. things. But now that I'm researching more mm -hmm. and there's so many um on the website there's so many helps regarding um yeah you know learning about the product line learning about the what are in the products and yeah. learning how to talk to people about the products yeah. um there's just so much so yeah so do you have to um like keep a, an expensive line of inventory at your salon in order to sell it to your clients no, that's another thing i am not mm -hmm. constantly going into mm -hmm. salon stores anymore because right. I'm just using this. Yeah, and I do keep a few things uh, in on hand. Right, because some people want to buy it outright. It? Oh yeah, mm -hmm. retail or Re something. Retail. Mm -hmm. Right. But for the most part, it's been great not to have to go to. They just salon order it directly store. from your mm -hmm. website. Right. Yeah, and you mm -hmm. get the commission automatically. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yep. That is so great. There's not many product lines that will pay you to use them right. <laughs> in your salon oh, and on yourself. Yes, exactly. <laughs> right? There's so many things about and it. And the other thing too that I've noticed that salon owners and um, stylists love about it, and you can tell me, is that there is the opportunity to make residual income, which means like when people are buying things and they buy multiple times because they run out of shampoo and conditioner so they buy again, right. then you're making money when you are not buying the chair. Like right. your commission is still coming in right. time after time when they're ordering yes, stuff. Exactly. Or when you have market partners under you that are also selling things 
um, your income increases right. and you don't have to be working all the time. Right. So you can actually take a vacation day once in a while. Yes. <laughs> and being self-employed, that's really nice. It's a big deal. It's a big deal. It's extra money. Yeah. So, so that is really mm -hmm. great for mm -hmm. um, for hairstylists. But you don't have to be a hairstylist to, no. to sell it, right. which is awesome because mm -hmm. all the training and everything is available to you guys. And we also, as a team, are super helpful and want to um, help you succeed because that helps helps all of us succeed as well. Right. So what would be your advice to a stylist or salon owner, or maybe they're totally not, maybe they're a client, maybe they're a friend, uh, maybe mm -hmm. they're just thinking like, would this be income that I could do? Like, could mm -hmm. I could I jump in and make an extra stream of income with mm -hmm. this, um, just on the side? What would be your advice to them? Um, my advice would be to check it out for yourself. Um, you know, use the products and, you know, it's easy to sell because there's not a lot to, you know, there's not even a big expense to get into it. Mm -hmm. So um, I think you just have to be passionate. You have to reach out to people. I think it helps stretch you to be um, more um, extrovertal. But, it, but you don't have to be. I mean, but it, yeah. it's easy to be. My you just be personable yeah. with your friends. Right. And, and I yeah. think that my confidence level has gotten up to a higher level because of the money as well. Mm -hmm. so, I agree. Mm -hmm. Yes, I've seen that. Yeah. It's so mm -hmm. good. The other thing, too, I forgot to say was, like, you don't have to just sell to your clients because they have friends and family, too. Right. So if, even if a client you know, purchase three times and then they were like, well, I'm going to take a break from purchasing, but hey, I have a family member, you know, maybe they have a friend across the nation in New York or mm -hmm. somebody in Canada that they know that means right. you would never have gotten connected with that person other than right. like they're connected to some yeah. other clients of yours. So you don't have to only go no. with your personal mm -hmm. friends and family or your client group, right. you know, it's yes. a very broad market. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and networking and um, just getting online and yeah. through Facebook mm -hmm. or um, the company it's set up too that you can send things through that are on the website to people. So that helps them to understand what the products are and you can explain that to them and reach out that way as well. Yeah, mm -hmm. awesome. Mm -hmm. So how can they reach out to you? If they have questions, they wanna get join your team, they wanna get in business with you. Um, and by the way, it's no risk to you because there's a 30 day money back guarantee, no right. matter how right. you order or if you jump into the business and you try it out for 30 days, mm -hmm. you can even send it back if you have to, but nobody that I know has, yeah, so. <laughs> right, nobody that I know. Either. No, uh -huh. so uh, uh, how can they contact you? Um, well, I have a Cut Loose Salon page mm -hmm. through that, or even Vicki Karras. Mm -hmm. um, I have um, a salon that you can call there. I can give the number. Yeah, um, go ahead. Mm -hmm. It's 231-922-9528, mm -hmm. or my cell is 231-313-0489. Awesome. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, you guys, she has a ton of expertise. I mean, she's been doing hair for over 35 years, owned her own business for over 25 years, right? Mm -hmm. And now jumping into this additional business is finding out that it's a blessing as well. So she just has a ton of expertise and a ton of wisdom, compassion, amazing heart, as you can tell, comes across mm -hmm. in everything she does. So you definitely want to be part mm -hmm. of her team if at all possible. So comment here, contact Vicki with her contact info that she just um, gave you. Let us know if you have any questions. We'd be happy to help you. Anything yes. else you want to say? Um, just, I feel very blessed. Um, and I'm really happy to be a part of this team with Emily yeah. and to meet so many people. Mm -hmm. And I'm excited because I, I get to meet people from all the United States, all over the place. So that's what's really cool. So I'm that hoping that you guys consider it. Yeah. Yep. Our arms are open to you. Mm -hmm. We would <laughs> love to have you. All right, guys. Yeah. We love you. Um, feel free to like and share this video. And again, let us know if you have any questions. See you later. See ya.